Payday loans may seem like a quick fix when you're short on cash, but they can cause you some major long-term problems. Now the federal government is looking to regulate payday lenders. Oakland's 8's Natalie Shaver is live on 17th Street where you can find many of these businesses. Natalie, right now it's up to each state to regulate payday lenders, right? That's right, Jay. And Idaho doesn't have any regulations that can keep those high interest rates down. And that's a problem that some people say really needs to be fixed. As far as I'm concerned, it is helping. It's one of the major things that, that helps keep people in poverty in poverty. Because it's a cycle people get stuck in. In order to pay off loan A, they get loan B. Um, in order to complete paying off loan A because of the high interest rate. Well, and, and these businesses are more than happy to let them do that, even though supposedly it's not supposed to happen. You won't believe how high some of those interest rates can go. I didn't. I had uh, a loan document from a client in my desk that had over 500% interest. It might not be a huge loan. It was like $300. So 500% would not have been a great deal of money, but um, to someone who needed the $300, 500% interest is a lot of money. These places are virtually unregulated in Idaho, and that's why Spain says they're everywhere. You just drive down the streets of Idaho Falls or any other town in Idaho uh, and count the number of, of payday, check and loans, title loans that are within a several block area. So that's what we did. Five already on 17, within about a block between two major streets. So you have this one, this big yellow one, cash loans, and then there's another one over here, like literally across the street. I ended up counting seven, all within walking distance. Spain isn't saying these places need to go, just that they need to be more regulated. Think twice before you do it. Look at all other possibilities. We did reach out to some of these businesses, but they were not able to comment. Reporting live in Idaho Falls, I'm Natalie Shaver. All right, thank you, Natalie. Again, the federal government is looking to regulate payday lenders. The proposed rule would require lenders to make sure borrowers can afford to pay the money back.